What's up guys, my name is Devin, also known as FB, and welcome to another episode of Footballers. Today we're going to be unboxing the Nike Vapor Edge 360 Pro, and I'm going to let you guys know what I think about the cleat, so let's get right into it. Bam guys, here they are, the Nike Vapor Edge 360 Speed, let me show you guys the box real quick. Nike Vapor Edge 360 Pro 8.5, this is a white and black colorway, it is your typical orange Nike box, the classic, you guys know it. Uh, so let's, let's open the thing, alright, here we go. Got some paper on top. Bam. 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 Woo -wee. Check these out. So these are the Nike Vapor Edge 360 Pro in the Illusion type colorway, also known as the Under Wraps. Um, not really a good way to showcase the cleat because you can't really see much about it, but I'm gonna try and give you guys the best view possible. All right, so this is the main version of the Nike Vapor series. Um, this is the Nike Vapor Edge 360 Pro. This is the $120 model right in the middle. It's their mid-tier cleat and probably the most popular cleat in football right now. Awesome, awesome, awesome. All right, guys, let's talk first impressions. So my first impression is what the heck, where are the laces? Well, to answer your questions, they are actually underneath this sheath, which is really, really cool. Um, they have the lacing. They have traditional laces underneath. I'm going to try and show you guys. Let me get this this piece of paper out all right and hopefully you guys can see i don't know if you really can but basically traditional laces underneath so this is called the ghost lacing system the lace is completely covered it's almost as if they're not there at all which is really cool um they did adopt this from soccer cleats which is awesome so the laces don't interfere when you're kicking the ball i think this is a genius idea because some of my football cleats some other players cleats have actually gotten caught in my laces and ripped them up which sucked so this is going to protect them from that so another thing I noticed right away is this sock liner. I'm a sucker for sock liners. If you guys watch the videos and follow me on Instagram, at football.equipment, you guys know I love, love, love sock liners. It's not even that they do a ton support-wise. It's just that they feel so good, um, you know, tightly around your ankle. I don't know what it is. It just makes me feel a lot more secure and confident while, you know, running, running routes, everything. Um, but I, I love this. I love how this cleat looks. The silhouette is beautiful, and this sock liner only adds to that. All right, guys, let's get this paper out of the toe so we can really dig into the cleat and kind of see how it works. If you guys watch the 360 speed video, you guys probably have an idea of what's to come. So here is the insole. It says vapor engineered for speed on it. And check this out. It's got these little tiny studs that actually line up with the plastic shank on the inside. So that, that insole is not going to slide around at all. This plastic shank replaces carbon fiber that has been on past Nike models. It's lightweight. It keeps that stiffness and it gives you a little bit of spring in your step. And of course, like I said, this insole is going to line up with those studs perfectly. So this thing is not going to be sliding around. Your foot is going to be secure in there. and It's going to be a solid, solid fit. Let's see if I can get this back in through the sock thing there. All right, we got it back in. Awesome. Another thing I noticed is this pull tab. I love when cleats have this. It makes, it makes putting them on so much easier. And some of the Nike Vapor cleats lately have been tougher and tougher to put on. Um, but this one looks like it'll be pretty easy to put on. Um, it's, it's really wide up there at the top there. So I'm sure this stretches and you can get your foot in uh, no problem. All right, guys, it's time to talk about this brand new Edge traction plate. So technically, this isn't new. This cleat was released in 2020, but it is on a two-year cycle. So these are still going to be Nike's Vapor cleats for this season in 2021. Um, so let's talk about the traction plate. So this is the Nike Edge Traction Plate. It is called the Edge Traction Plate because it has these edge studs on the outermost part of your foot and that make cutting a breeze. These edge studs grip into the ground so well and allow you to change directions, no problem. Also, I want to note that yes, this is a two-piece traction plate. This is the first time Nike's done this on football cleats in a very long time. Um, it eliminates that little bit of weight right here and that little plastic shank basically acts as if it's a full-size traction plate. So you've got your forefront plate up here with all the edge technology, and then you have just four really sharp studs in the back. Again, I want to talk about these studs. They are so sharp. They grip into the ground so well. Yes, I have tested them before. Um, amazing traction plate. You guys are going to get the full review on this football cleat soon, so be on the lookout for that. I love this football cleat. Just, just a, just a pre-warning there. Um, but yeah, it's a great football cleat. It looks amazing. This under wraps colorway is so sweet. I love the ghost lacing system. I love the ankle collar, and I love pretty much everything about this cleat. So there you have it. That is the unboxing of the Nike Vapor Edge 360 Pro. Let me know what you guys think about these cleats in the comments below. And if you guys did enjoy this video, consider hitting like, comment, and subscribe for more videos like this. My name is Devin, also known as FB, and thank you guys so much for tuning in to another episode of Footballers.